Congratulations on your purchase of the Videonics MX1 Digital Video Mixer. And welcome to the world of multiple video source mixing, switching, and special effects generation. This videotape that you're watching was designed to get you started with the necessary connections and the basic operation of the MX-1. We recommend that you view this tape once in its entirety prior to hooking up the MX-1 to your video editing system. And then watch it once again as you connect and begin operation of the MX-1. Before we begin introducing the MX-1 to your video setup, let's take a quick look at what this digital video mixer can do. The Videonics MX-1 Digital Video Mixer is a video production switcher that is capable of receiving the outputs of up to four different video sources. You may plug into the MX-1 any combination of VCRs, video camcorders, title generators, television tuners, or even the video output of most home computers. Once connected, you may perform a variety of transitions between any two video sources, such as wipes, dissolves, straight cuts, flips, tumbles, and a number of combination wipe and dissolve transitions. A quick note, up until recently all the previously shown transitions required the use of special time-based corrected VCRs, television studio cameras, a separate digital video effects generator, and a very expensive video switcher to combine all the various video inputs. Needless to say, these effects were only available to high-end production companies and television networks. However, thanks to the technology created by Videonics, all of these video transitions have been made accessible on the MX-1 for a mere fraction of the price. The MX-1's mixer and switcher functions are only the beginning of what your new digital video mixer can do. In addition to displaying multiple video sources, the MX-1 can also produce background colors as well as borders that will be of a color decided by you. There are nine preset background and border colors built into the MX-1 and a custom-made color of your choice can be created for a total of 10 background and border colors that can be used in transitional wipes or in a special function called the compose mode. Most digital video mixers allow you to perform an effect called picture in picture where one video picture is compressed into a box and placed over another full screen picture. Sure the MX-1 can do that but only with the Videonics MX-1's compose function can you create an infinite number of still pictures of varying sizes and shapes combined with background colors, lines and borders. An entire video collage can reside right on your television monitor and be recorded into your video production. The MX-1 can take any video source and add a variety of digital input effects such as changing your entire color video picture to black and white or transforming your normal picture into a negative. A reverse image can be a mirror image of your original picture. Or how about turning your whole world upside down? And adding a touch of mosaic. Turning on the strobe will slow down your frame rate, and when combined with the black and white mode, you can recreate the look of a film camera. And posterization and solarization can turn an otherwise ordinary scene into a beautiful oil painting. The MX-1 performs several keying functions, such as luminance key, where the darker portions of one video picture is replaced by another. However, the most popular key effect that you're probably familiar with is chroma key. You've seen the weatherman on the evening news pointing out the cold fronts moving in from the east. You've also seen your favorite superhero leap from building to building in a single bound with no strings attached. And you probably even wondered how you might be able to join your favorite TV star on his show. The effect that you're watching is called chroma key and all it takes is a solid color background of let's say blue or green, a video camera, and the Videonics MX-1 digital video mixer. You just stand in front of the background and the MX-1 fills in the background color with whatever scene you like. Tell me that this effect isn't going to keep you up at night thinking of the possibilities. So let's take a few minutes to connect your new MX-1 into your video system. To get started, here's what you'll need. One or more video sources such as a camcorder or VCR, ideally at least two video monitors, a VCR to record your work onto, and the user's manual which contains all the information needed for setup and usage. Begin by placing your MX-1 on your editing workstation somewhere in the proximity of your other video equipment. Connect the included power supply to the back of the MX-1 and plug it into a nearby outlet. Attach a video cable to the video output of one of your video sources. If your camcorder, VCR, laser displayer, or video equipped computer has an S-video output jack, use an S-video cable to make this connection for the optimum results between Super VHS and high band 8 video equipment. 
If this type of connection is not available, merely use the composite RCA style jacks and the respective cables. Connect the other end of this video cable to the number one video input jack on the MX-1. If your video source emits audio, then connect the audio outputs on your camcorder or VCR to the audio inputs on the MX-1 next to your video connection. If you have a second video source, such as a camcorder or VCR, connect it in the same manner to input number two on the MX-1. Third and fourth video sources can also be connected at this time if you have them. Use either an S-video cable or an RCA-style cable to connect the main video output of the MX-1 to your recording VCR, which should already have a video monitor connected to it. For demonstration purposes, you can bypass the connection to a recording VCR and connect the MX-1 directly to a video monitor. This will be called your program or output monitor. Make a connection between the preview output on the MX-1 with your other video monitor with an RCA-style video cable and this will be your preview monitor. If one of your video sources is a camcorder, turn on the camera section and remove the lens cap, or leave it in the playback mode and begin playing back a pre-recorded videotape. If your other video sources are either VCRs, laser disc players, or title generators, place them in the play mode. Now you can turn on your video editing system, beginning with the power to your video sources, followed by your recording VCR and or monitors, and then the power switch on the MX-1 digital mixer. What you will see when the MX-1 is first turned on is the Videonics logo screen, followed by your number one video input source displayed on your output monitor, and the preview screen displayed on your preview monitor. At the top of the preview screen are four miniature preview images, which show the pictures of all video sources connected to the MX-1, as well as the currently selected background and border colors. The lower half of the preview screen displays the available transitions. Let's try one of them. Use the arrow key on the MX-1's control panel to move the cursor on the preview screen over and down to transition number 15. Tap the speed button on the control panel until the number 3 appears in the bottom of the transition box. Now push play on the MX-1's control panel and you will see a picture shuffle transition between your two video input sources. Let's try that again. This time, use the numeric keypad on the MX-1 to enter the number 22 and press the OK button. As you can see, transition effect number 22 has become highlighted, and that will be the type of transition that takes place when you press the play button on the MX-1. Another way of performing a transition is by manually moving the T-bar on the MX-1 from one position to another. You can even stop the transition in progress by placing the T-bar halfway. There are over 200 different transition effects on the Videonics MX-1, and getting to them is as simple as using your arrow key to move the cursor from page to page on the preview screen, or just by entering the transition effect number into the numeric keypad and pressing play. Included with your instructional manual is an MX-1 digital video mixer reference card that lists every possible transition effect and its respective number. Also available from Videonics is a one-hour instructional videotape produced by the digital mixer experts at Videocam Productions that will literally take you through each and every function that your new MX-1 mixer is capable of performing, including the creation of transitions and effects that go beyond anything that you can read about. You may obtain this videotape at a special offer price by calling 1-800-338-EDIT. As you can see, the Videonics MX-1 Digital Video Mixer is literally an entire television studio built into one box. So take the time to learn the potential of your new MX-1 and realize that it is a very powerful video production tool. And its only limitation is your imagination. Your videos look great, but are they still lacking that professional polish? 
you need a titler that looks as good as your productions. Now, all your videos can have the professional quality you need to make the difference between amateurish and stylish. The Videonics TitleMaker 2000 is the newest breakthrough in video character generation. Using digital video quality, the TitleMaker 2000 produces letter resolution that surpasses Super VHS or Hi8. Titles can be superimposed over any video source or over colored and patterned backgrounds, and there are 24 special effects for transitions between title screens, including wipes, fades, and cuts, all at eight speeds. The TitleMaker 2000 has over 90 font and size combinations. The fonts are specifically designed to look great on video and include smooth, stylized, and decorative lettering, and each line of text can be enhanced with drop shadows, several grades of bolding, and outline. The letters are sharp with smooth curves and crisp edges. There are over a million colors to choose from for titles, outlines, borders, and backgrounds. Choose from a set of animated patterns such as rainbow or twinkling stars to give your titles a unique look. With the TitleMaker 2000, you can create separate scripts to keep your projects organized. And with a seven-year lithium battery, your titles will stay in memory even when the unit is turned off. TitleMaker 2000 has preview capability, allowing you to change titles on a second monitor without interrupting the main video source. With the TitleMaker 2000's 8,000 character memory, hundreds of titling pages are possible and all text can be scrolled up the screen or crawled across in any direction and all at eight speeds. The title maker has a full keyboard with accented characters supporting 18 other languages such as French, Spanish, and German. And there are special characters like diamonds, dots, checks, and hearts. If you need to make high quality video productions, then you need TitleMaker 2000 from Videonix. At last, a video editor that controls more than one deck and bridges the gap between amateurs and professionals. Videonix Edit Suite. Together with any multiple source mixer, Edit Suite is a powerful AB roll edit controller with twice the features of editors costing thousands more. Edit Suite can control four sources and hold up to 250 scenes in memory. And with its advanced editing functions, Edit Suite measures up to the most demanding productions. Videonix Edit Suite takes advantage of decks with Control L and Panasonic Control M for amateurs. And at the same time, Edit Suite controls decks with professional protocols like RS-232 and 422 for true broadcast compatibility. No other standalone edit controller has so much flexibility. At the same time, Videonix Edit Suite reads all standard time codes. Sony RC, Sempty Vitsi, and longitudinal time code for frame accuracy. Edit Suite is designed to work optimally with Videonix Digital Video Mixer, allowing A, B, C, and D roll. A, B roll is just as easy as marking the in and out point of the first source, selecting a transition with the mixer, and choosing the in out points of the second source. While edits can be controlled separately, Edit Suite will automatically assemble the segment and even sets a match frame if needed. With Edit Suite, building an edit decision list is easy. Just find the in and out points of the scenes you want. As you work, Edit Suite keeps all the edit data stored for retrieval, even if the unit is turned off. 
Edit Suite's EDL is contained in an easy to understand backlit display. All important information is at your fingertips with no need for an external monitor. Videonics Edit Suite has two separate GPI triggers. Automatically trigger another mixer or titler at any point. For advanced editing, Edit Suite can insert and split audio or video segments with the appropriate equipment. Edit Suite can also communicate with computer platforms to save and restore edit decision lists or export CMX EDLs for online use. If you need to move up to a higher level, move up to the Edit Suite from Videonics.